Hi guys, uh, I'm going to show you today how to set the endpoints, the throttle endpoints for your uh, your ESCs. A lot of people have problems in uh, in knowing how to set that. It's very simple, really. All we're going to do is we're going to take our radio, we're going to switch it on, okay, and we're going to put our throttle stick all the way to the top. Once we plug in the uh, battery for our uh, airplane or helicopter it'll see the high stick point and after a certain amount of beeps we will lower that so it sees the low point please remember that uh, when doing this it's best to remove your propeller or blades from your helicopter just in case anything uh, untoward could happen we don't want anybody cutting themselves or helicopters flying all over the house destroying stuff so uh, take the blades or propellers off Okay, so throttle at high, radio switched on, I'm going to plug in the battery, you will hear a series of beeps, after the first series of beeps I will lower the throttle, here we go. And that's it, our high and low points have now been set. If I uh, raise the throttle now, there we go. Okay. So we have the uh, the endpoint set. This uh, is the general method for your sort of low budget ESCs. The higher end market ones uh, have tend to have a program card that comes with it, which will. Um, dictate how you set the endpoints but for uh, most of the ones that you're going to buy the cheap ones that you buy you put in your foamy planes and and things like that that don't come with a a program card this is the uh, the standard method for setting your endpoints I'm just going to show you what happens if you don't lower the throttle soon enough and you'll start to hear it go into all sorts of weird beeps so let me unplug Okay, so I'll switch it back on, I'll set it to high throttle, and this time I'll forget to drop it to low throttle and see what happens. Okay, so now it's gone into program mode and all these beeps are telling you different things that are going to change. If I was to lower my throttle stick now, it would set a parameter within the ESC which might be the wrong parameter so you uh, you have to know uh, what parameters are going to change if you just unplug the uh, it's very annoying isn't it if you just unplug the battery yeah that's better if you just unplug the battery it will stop the uh, ESC from being programmed and you can do it all over again I hope this helps you and uh, Look forward to seeing you on the forum.